Hey art friends, today we're gonna draw a funny sea creature. What are we gonna draw? A shrimp. Yeah, a funny shrimp. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. It's gonna be a lot of fun. You need something to draw with. We're gonna use markers, but you could use whatever you have. You also need some paper and something to color with. Yeah, all right, let's start. Yes. <laughs> let's first draw our shrimp's head. We're gonna draw a big circle. I'm gonna draw my shrimp huge. I'm also drawing them towards the left a little bit and towards the top of our paper so that we have room for the body. Now let's draw the face. I'm gonna draw the mouth first. I'm gonna draw a W right in the middle. Then I'm also gonna draw a circle on the left and a circle on the right for the eyes. He's already looking funny. Yeah. <laughs> we can draw a smaller circle inside of each eye for the highlight and then let's color in the big circle, but leave the little circle white. Now remember, any time that we fast forward the video, or if you need more time, what can they do? Pause it. Yeah, you can pause the video. All right, let's keep going. Okay. Now let's draw the body to our shrimp. Let's start right here, the bottom of the circle, and we're gonna draw a curve that comes down. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna draw the top, or the back of the body. We're gonna start up here towards the top of the circle, and we're gonna curve down like this, and then watch this. At the bottom, I'm gonna get really close to the first line we drew. Yeah, and then down here, let's draw a curve to connect those two lines. Now we're gonna draw the legs. Let's draw a big sideways U shape. And I'm gonna draw two right next to each other. <laughs> then let's draw two more sideways U shapes. Now we got four, and then let's do two more to make six. I think that's how many legs they have. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's disgusting. Yep. Okay, now... <laughs> well, shrimps taste good, though. I, I think it does. Yeah, until you think about what you're eating. Yeah. And then it's gross. And then you just want to get all the cocktail sauce yes. and more butter. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now let's draw the tail. We're going to draw a big U-shape. That starts at the top or the inside of the body and it comes around and connects to the outside. Okay, and then let's draw another U shape, but we're only gonna draw part of it because the other part is behind the first shape. Okay, and then let's repeat that same curve over here on this side. Okay, now let's draw a few more lines on the body for the texture, the, gr the gross part. I'm gonna draw a line down, down the middle. <laughs> And then we're gonna draw curves to make our shrimp look more 3D. And this curve is gonna match the same curve that we up, have up here for the circle. For part of the circle, I'm gonna draw a curve like that. Look at that, now it looks like it's more round. Then let's draw another one below it. And one more down here at the bottom. Cool, what's our shrimp missing? Antennas. Yeah, it really makes me think that these are insects. That's why yeah. I think they're not that. Tasty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's draw the antennas. We're just gonna draw a curvy S line. We're gonna start at the top of the head. We're gonna curve up, down, and then back the other direction. Yeah, and then let's do that same shape, but we're gonna overlap them. So I'm gonna start here. We'll draw a big curve like this, and then we'll curve back up. Yeah, that's really gross. <laughs> And we did it. I, I think that's what a shrimp looks like. Uh, not really. <laughs> I think it looks a little different in real life. Yeah. But this is a cartoon one. Yeah. So that's okay. Let's leave it just like this. We're, we still need to do one more step though. Color. Yeah, this is my favorite part. Uh, we are gonna fast forward, but at the end, you can pause the video if you wanna match our same coloring. Although we're just gonna color them pink. pink. Yeah. All right, let's fast forward. Okay. Five, you did such a great job on coloring your entire shrimp pink. Yeah. Now we use markers to color our drawings, but you can use whatever you have at home. And we use two colors, right? Well, yeah. two different pinks. We used a regular pink and a dark pink. The dark pink is for the shading to make it look more 3D. I also used a white colored pencil to add a highlight, but you can leave all of that off just to keep this lesson a little easier. What else could our art friends add to this drawing? A background. Oh yeah, a background would be way cool. You could add 
the ocean, maybe even other fish, or even small little baby shrimp. Yeah. <laughs> we hope you had a lot of fun drawing your shrimp. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye.